extensively refurbished and remodelled at her original builders, Delta Marine, in 2019, Elsie is a replica Dutch Lux Motor 57. Built in 2005, she is 57 foot with a beam of 12 foot 8 and a maximum draft of 3 foot. She has a steel hull with two cabins and two heads. She is packed with features including a variable speed centrifugal water pump which delivers a quiet constant and even flow and you can even monitor the usage via a handy app. Elsie has cruised the River Medway, the English Channel, Belgium, the Netherlands and of course the non-tidal Thames, which is where we came to visit her. Elsie is a stunning boat with full capability to live aboard. Stay tuned for a full walkthrough. Get ready to be wowed. Welcome back again. Hi. And we are aboard another boat. We are. Oh, we're really doing some poking around lately. <laughs> it's so nosy. It's brilliant, isn't it? <laughs> this is a beautiful boat. Her name is Elsie. And she is a replica Dutch barge. Delta mm. Marine. Yeah. Um, updated in 2019. Um, lots of sort of upgrades and updates yeah, and bits was... and bobs that the owners have done. 2005 wasn't it originally built yeah, yeah. and taken back to the manufacturer that did it mm -hmm. stripped right down and all redone yeah and they added bits didn't they they extended bits they changed a lot yeah yeah, yeah but it's lovely yeah we're excited to show you this one she <laughs> is a stunner let's have a poke around here we are my new boat. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. Look at that wheel. Look at this. Do you know, the good thing, like you said earlier, is you, you stand here and you're in the middle. It's a great view, look isn't it? Look at that view. That's yeah. amazing. Yeah, but look at this. This array. It's push, look, it's button start, no key. Just push on, glow plug start. <laughs> what else have we got here, Richard? Rudder controls. Bow thruster. So you've got your normal bow thruster controls. Two VHF radios, wow. so you can be on both channels. <laughs> Huge control panel. That's all your, all your fuses, isn't it, and switches, and your multi control. <laughs> Raymarine chart plotter. Wow. <laughs> that's all your depth speed log. <laughs> that's the normal engine one. Eh? We've yeah. all got that, haven't we? Yeah. And then you've got target two. So that's like a digital compass, isn't it? I think. And then the new Victron battery monitor. But it comes with a radar as well, doesn't it? So you've mm -hmm. got the full-on radar system out on the mast, but that's taken off at the moment. It literally just plugs in and you put it on there. Yeah. But you don't like it when he's on the Thames thinking it's a bit overkill. <laughs> but the great thing is, it's, it's so cosy in here, isn't it? It is, it's lovely. And you've got a radiator right here, so you'd be like, yeah. oh, in the winter. And, oh, not like us with all our coats on, <laughs> freezing. Now, you've even got a little seat as well. I can sit here and keep an eye on you whilst you're steering. So, um, as you can see, they have a wheelhouse. This boat has been under Osney Bridge. So for those of you that know how low Osney Bridge is, she yeah. does fit with the wheelhouse taken down. She's six foot six. Yeah. With and, everything collapsed. And um, they do also have, um, there's uh, metal struts out there that once the wheelhouse is down, you can pop them up and have a, bim a bimini cover you can as just well. see them. They're, they're just tied outside yeah. to keep them outside. And I'll spin you around. When, when this top's all off and put away, they actually go into these little clips here. So they go into these. Yeah. And there's another one at the front. So you've got a full-on convertible, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. So you can still have a roof up, get mm. to the next bridge, just drop it down like we do. Yeah. Under the bridge, pull it back up again. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's sort of... Um, Multi-purpose, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is, definitely. They've, um, they've made... One of the changes they made is they um, had this chair or this seating this... area uh, raised because it was very low before, so you couldn't see out the windows, which then has created some sort of so shoe, shoe rack. storage <laughs> yeah. space. Sorry, all of our rubbish is down there at the yeah. moment. Um, so that was like one of the... The first things that the owner put. You couldn't see out the windows, could you? Yeah, no. You were no. sat on the thing so low, you were like, yeah. what's going on here? So they had that. So. Uh, and then, let's go, we're going to go into. Let me get... 
into the aft cabin, first of all, at the back here. Now this shuts off as well, so you can close that. Oh, it well. does, so yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all fully closable. Yep, yep. But yeah, so you open these little hatches. And then come down here. <clears throat> now, you know, like men get told to go to your shed. Yeah. This is my shed. Yeah, this will be your shed. <laughs> Head yeah. is not a shed. <laughs> it is beautiful. So, isn't in it? here, you've got um, one little um, bed here, which underneath as well is all complete storage underneath there. He keeps his bike underneath there. Yeah. He? He's yeah. got a Brompton that he keeps under there. Um, another bed apparently this one used to be lower but they had this is another one of the things they had changed was they brought it up so you've got all of this storage under here you've got drawers and even um, again if you lift this up you, I, I won't do it but you can see there's storage all the way under here too it goes right to because what that was that was walled off wasn't it mm. so they knocked that wall out because it was only a wooden wall with storage behind it so you had like a shed really you had a massive, great big shed in the yeah. back of your boat. So they used half of that space and moved the bed up. And it totally makes sense, doesn't it? Mm. Oh. <laughs> I'm just going to fall down. <laughs> um, you've got some good cupboards in here as well. Nice big cupboard there. You've got, like I said, the drawers. Um, and then... You've got plugs. You've got plugs. Oh. You've also got an ensuite, which Richard, it's probably easier okay. if you go in there yeah. because you have. So this is your own. A you've sink, got your sink. Got your pump out toilet. You've got your toilet, and then you come in, and you turn a corner, and you've even got your own little shower. Tell you what, look. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> it's all right. It's. I tell you what. There's no. It's the same size as when we had on a narrowboat. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Again, shower. <laughs> Do -do -do. Okay, as you can see, there's a couple of oars here, and if Richard swings round, that's for the little rowboat tender out You can see it just the out there, so that hangs on the back. It's all proper mounts. Yep. Um, they, they've dropped that down quite a few times, haven't they? It's yep. so easy just to plonk it in the water and clip it and row off. But it's, oh, it's lovely being back here, isn't it? <laughs> right, so back up in to the wheelhouse. There's your bum. <laughs> so we come back up. Come back up and then into the main salon. And then we're going back Actually, down. Actually into the galley. <laughs> okay, and if we sort of swing around first, so you've got a um, lovely big storage cupboard in there with hanging space. You have, like a lot of these boats, you've got storage under the steps as well. Um, here you've got the Wi-Fi, etc. Nice big, um, the owner said that they normally use this as like the larder cupboard for eggs and bread and stuff like that, but obviously they've got all of their sort of documents in there at the moment. And then, fridge freezer. He said, excuse him, he's on for the weekend, so. <laughs> yeah, he's got a little this, freezer. This is what he's surviving on, bless him. And this is a drinks cooler. Yeah, so you can put all your drinks in there. Yeah. So it's, it's quite cool, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> cool. Um, the photos definitely on the site don't do this boat justice. It's really light and airy and it looks... It's lovely. Yeah, it's, it looks a little bit dark in the photo, so hopefully this will give you a good perspective. Um, induction hob and oven. Um, full electric. Full electric. No gas on this boat either. No, they took it off, didn't they? Yeah. Um, a really lovely black sink, black taps. Just the finishes are really beautiful. Because the kitchen was all done, wasn't it? Mm. All the worktops were all done and this was all new. They chose mm. this, didn't they? Um, <clears throat> you've got, you know, numerous drawers. Here you've got, oh, dishwasher. Richard might want to come round and show. This is really nice because it's slimline dishwasher, but it's got it's the got little the rack. rack at the top, top, which is really good. Apparently when it's on, the time comes out and shines on yeah, the floor. Tells you how long floor. it is till it's finished. It's a bit snazzy, isn't it? Yeah. More storage. Um, and they had this, the countertops changed, and this um, 
added as well. So you've got a little breakfast bar area with the stools. You've also got a microwave. Now he opened this some snazzy way. I think it was yeah. like that. But it's also a combi, a combi one. So it's got a grill, grill function as yeah, well. Yeah, they used to the grill in there. Everything is so clean and immaculate. Yeah. It's like brand new. And the good thing is you've got a massive battery bank on this. Was it 10 batteries on this? Yeah, something like and that. And is it a 14 kilowatt generator? Yeah. Huge generator. Yeah. That will power everything on this boat all turned on at once. Yeah. And we'll Amazing. show you some more extras. <laughs> um, again, another little additional cupboard there. Lots of storage. Uh, there's a little cupboard here into the... No, that's not little. Well, actually, it's a huge cupboard. It's massive. Yeah, it's a massive cupboard. <laughs> it goes on all the way. Um, this boat comes with basic furniture, um, TVs, etc. Um, yeah, so we're now in the, the main lounge area. Again, loads of storage. We've got four, no, well, two double cupboards and a sort of single cupboard here. Lots and lots of storage space. Oh, the cupboards go on. Oh, it just on, goes they? on, yeah. And all up here. You've got a diesel stove. It is Lovely, toasty in here. Really toasty. And the brilliant thing about this we were discussing is that it's open all the way around. Pretty much, yeah, all yeah. the way around. I'll take you around because you can see the bin the other where they've put the bin the other yeah. side. And then they've done something really clever, haven't they? Which well, we haven't seen before. Before we get there, let's just show the TV. <laughs> and the fact that it has air conditioning. It's got an air conditioning machine. Well, it's got an air pump, hasn't it? So it's, heating... a, it's a heat pump and air conditioning. So you can have it on in the winter to pump hot air around the boat. Yeah. Or in the summer, you put it on and it apparently it works really well. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, TV. All on a bracket, that is, as yeah, well. Yeah, that, that's mo all movable on a bracket. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, gosh. She says, and then probably wrecks the place. It is, yeah. <laughs> double glazed. Completely double glazed, yeah. It's beautiful. It's absolutely yeah. beautiful. You got your dog box, lovely and light. And he did say he's got um, the full sort of canopy cover for that as well. Yeah, put it over in the it. summer, stop the sun coming in. Yeah. That's all done. Everything's double glazed in there. Isn't it? Yeah. It's, it's, honestly, it's pristine, this oh, boat. It's, it's beautiful. And this is a really clever This is what you bench. like. So that's a diesel stove or diesel fireplace. Mm. So it's got its own fuel tank for that. So you'll never run out of diesel no. on your engine. But then that goes up. You can see where the chimney goes up. And then there's this unit. They've made a little airing the, cupboard. The chimney is actually behind the grill. And there's an airing cupboard. God, you can feel it, how warm that it's is. It's really warm. I mean, that how, toasty in how there. clever is that? And they put the vent on the door I as well. I have never seen an airing cupboard on a boat. Well, I, there probably are some, but I've never seen one in here. No, we haven't seen one. It was so like, clever. That is brilliant. brilliant. You put clever. your towels in there and stuff, didn't you? The other really good thing is this they is actually like. have a separate tumble, tumble dry. dryer. Yeah. And a separate washing, washing machine. machine. So you've got a washing machine, tumble dryer. And again, yeah. you can have both of those on with the generator running. Yeah. Because it will power, like it I said. Powers it all, yeah. Even the oven and everything on with yeah. that, it will power the lot. Amazing. Um, nice big cupboard there. Got the hoover in there, so it shows you how big it is. Um, an additional little skylight here, yeah, which is really nice, which opens as well. It does make it, and it's still warm because, mm. again, you're by the fire, look. Mm. <laughs> Um, into their main bathroom, which has a bath. Yeah, bath, shower. Yeah, oh yeah, shower. Pump out toilet. <laughs> yeah. Again, this um, boat is, is it a Category C as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah so you can go to sea in this. You can take this one out to sea and they have done, haven't they? They've they have, gone yeah. across the channel, yeah. So, yeah, beautiful. And then into the main cabin. Which is carpeted as well, which is nice. I love the carpet in this boat. It's so soft mm, on my feet. It's really spongy, isn't it? Yeah. A lovely big bed. 
We've got a um, wall mounted TV. We've got a nice big cupboard here. Again, loads of drawers. Oh yeah. Two drawers down there, another three there. You've got um, side cupboards either side of the bed. I need to spin it round. There's a and it's really lovely because you in the window you can see straight out onto the bow, can't you? Yeah. And that's your escape hatch as well. Yeah. So that pops open. There's your little side units. Little cupboards. And then again, a big wardrobe here. This one is part of the, of the um, wardrobe, the other side. But you, I mean, that's still, I could get in that. Look. A bit. Shows up. <laughs> so it's big. Oh, yeah. So you've got, a full, you've got a full length wardrobe. Yeah. <laughs> and then you've got a little bit of hanging it's, space it's deep beyond the though, door. as well. Um, they're. Big red. Their tank is under the bed, isn't it? The water tank is under the tank. bed. Yeah. And it was how much, Richard? It was massive. It was, almost, it was twice the size of ours. So it was over, I'd say 1,300, 1,200 like litres. I want to say like 1,200, about 1,200 litres. Big water tank. Big water but they got the same in diesel. Yeah. I think they got more actually in diesel storage because you've got two tanks, I believe, for the diesel. Right. Um, it's radiators throughout, as it's, well as your heat pump and your stove. So. You're it's, not going to get it's cold. It's lovely and warm in here, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's really and lovely. And it's so quiet. Yeah, it is. Double it? glazing makes a big difference, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. nothing. I just love the carpet. <laughs> it's really soft on my toes. You can tell someone that don't have much carpet experience. Can't you? Yeah, I know. <laughs> I sound like I'm from a cave now. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. I'm back out into the lounge area. Beautiful. So there we go. If you uh, love Elsie as much as we do, which is the oh, name of this beautiful do. boat, um, <laughs> she is on sale um, at Shepperton Marina Boat Showrooms of London, and she's on sale for two seven five. Two seven five, yeah. Yeah, All which in. there's a lot of boat for your money, definitely. I tell you what, you, yeah, you do get. Yeah, and she's pristine. Her paintwork, everything about her is immaculate. So there is so much more detail that we probably haven't even oh, gone into. Loads. So loads. again, I'll put the link into the description, um, which you can go on the website and you can read about all the specs. Um, the engine, we haven't gone in the engine bay. Um, yeah, because there's a lot more. It's big down there as well. Yeah, <laughs> a lot more to read up. Apparently there's a ladder yeah. to get down there. So. Yeah, oh yeah. Um, yeah, so beautiful boat uh, definitely worth a look and if you enjoyed that video give us a cheeky little like <laughs> and we'll see you next time <laughs> thanks bye, bye.